there's no such thing as a perfect relationship what we have are people that have made up their minds to make the the necessary sacrifice to sustain their relationships and so the first the first and the most important thing you know in that journey is for the person to know himself know herself and know the person that you're going into a relationship with you 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 cannot for instance as as a as a marketer you work in a bank you're a marketer and you're in a relationship with somebody else that works in a bank and is a marketer you know and then you say i have found my missing reap and one of the expectations you have from the from the relationship is that you're not going to have a house help and you don't eat food that is frozen your food has got to be warm and fresh and immediately made before you eat you know your wife cannot provide that for you and so what will what will happen is that you get to a point where you guys begin to have misunderstandings and then you might tell her to quit her job then she'll tell you to quit your job and then you say i'm tired of this and then you break up so you, you discover that every relationship is capable of work working if you are prepared to make the sacrifice to sustain it and so if you ask me when do you know you found your perfect match i think it is when you have found that person for whom you are willing to make all the sacrifice love is worth the battle you fight for it but the question is are you fighting that battle for the right person and you see it's not the kind of battle you fight and turn around and say you're not being appreciated it's a battle that you fight because it is the right thing to do because of the value that it adds and so if after everything you do the person still doesn't see you the way you want to be seen will you continue to love see and so until you've made up your mind to say i would rather have you in my life with all your troubles than not have you in my life at all then you haven't hit that part you have to strike that chord you know because love doesn't sustain a relationship love is not enough it is sacrifice that sustains a relationship but when the sacrifice is inspired by love it makes the sacrifice an easier burden to bear mm -hmm.